Okay, well, listen, you three obviously have your fingers on the Bravo Pulse. So you're going to have to remove them to do some very public finger pointing. It is time to play Who Was at Fault? I'm going to walk us through some of the most epic feuds ever to appear on Bravo. You're going to say who's to blame. The ultimate question, who was at fault in the demise of their friendship, Bethany or Jill? Uh, Essie Cup. Jill. Megan. Jill. Jerry O. I'm always team Bethany, except when it comes to Bethany and Carol. I'm saying Jill was at fault. All right. Who was to blame in the years of family drama between them, Teresa or Melissa? Essie Cup. Teresa. Megan McCain. Teresa, and it was wrong. Jerry O. Teresa's been upset since Melissa was on the show day one. Yep, yep. Who was the most at fault in their years of constant arguing and disagreements, Nini or Kim Zosiak, S.E. Cup? <laughs> Ooh, that's tough. Um, Nini did a lot of baiting and Kim did a lot of taking. <laughs> yep. Megan. Yeah. You know what, I'm Nini, it's like I can never quit her. Like I love her and it doesn't matter what she does that's so bad. I love her till the end of time. So for whatever reason, she's one of those people that always gets a pass with me, which is weird, but I, Jer- I love her. Jerry O. Everything Megan just said, you know, <laughs> Kim, Nini can't be the, e- at times can't be the easiest to get along with, but Kim is, uh, Kim is a little out there sometimes. Yeah. Who was at fault? Whose side were you on for Puppygate? Vanderpump or everyone else? S.E. Cup. Everybody else. Megan McCain. I mean, everybody else. I agree. And I, I did, Vanderpump was one that was easy for me to quit, for whatever that's worth. Jerry like, I don't miss her. No. Uh, I'm actually not over Vanderpump yet. It's been interesting watching a Vanderpump-less Beverly Hills this season and who is sort of gunning for that throne. I think Dorit is making a big play for it. Uh, I think Kyle is. Kyle. Kyle is. I'm I'm team Dorit. (laughs) All right.